Hi, welcome to Samsung's video how-to guides. My name's Chris, and I'm going to show you how to transfer images from your digital camera to your computer. I want to start off by saying that there are many different ways to transfer your images. I'm just going to cover one way, but I think that you have the most control over where your images are stored by doing it this way. Also, in this video, I'm assuming you're either running Windows XP or Vista. If you are, there's no need to install the drivers because Windows will recognize your camera automatically. If you're running Windows 98, ME, NT, or 2000, you have to install the drivers from the CD. If you haven't, your computer may not recognize your camera and you won't be able to transfer your images. To install the drivers, get the CD that came with your camera and run it in your computer. Follow the prompts that come up and it will install everything you need automatically. Okay, with that being said, let's get started. First, let's get the couple things that we need to move our images to our computer. We'll need the digital camera, a USB cable that came with the camera, and a PC running Windows 98 or newer. The first step is to connect the camera using the USB cable. Do this with the camera off. The cable only fits one way in the camera and the computer, so don't force it. If you can't get it in, turn it around and try the other way. Now that we have our camera connected, it's time to turn it on. A message will appear asking you either PC or printer. Choose PC and set the camera down. Your computer will recognize the camera when you choose PC. Give it a second and open My Computer. The camera will show up as a removable disk with a drive letter. Double click to open it, then double click on the DCIM folder. Now, depending on how many images you have stored in your memory card, you will see one or more folders. Each folder holds around 99 images, and a new folder is automatically created by your camera when the limit for one folder is reached. The folders are labeled 101 SSCAM, 102 SSCAM, 103 SSCAM, etc., and they contain all of your images. Double click to open the folder containing your images you want to transfer, and then resize the window to fit about half of your screen. Now right click on the start button and left click on explore. This opens up the window we are going to save our images to. This is the part that may seem a little tricky. You're going to have to remember where you save your images. The easiest place to remember is in the My Pictures folder, which is on the C drive in most cases. Double click it to open it and resize it to fit half the screen not occupied by our other window. To move your images from your camera to your computer, you can simply drag them from the camera folder to the My Pictures folder. Let me give you a couple quick tips for transferring images to your PC. If you hold down the control button and click on different images, they all stay highlighted. You can then release the control button and drag and drop all of the selected images to your My Pictures folder. The last tip for this video is selecting a large group of images and it's very similar to the control button tip. To do this, highlight the first image in the group you want to select. Then scroll down to the last image in the group. Press and hold the control and shift buttons and then click the last image in your group. Notice that all of the images between the first and last images are highlighted. You can now drag and drop those images into the My Pictures folder. I hope this video was helpful. For Samsung, I'm Chris. Thank you.